Hello, my people. My name is Rashida Tanwa Ogunike. And I'm still your nail tech, your nail tutor. No, be just nail tech, nail tutor. Because I've been trained for this one, why I did. I have here my students, my beautiful students, as always. Imochinaza. And then today, we will talk about prepping of nails. So when we talk about prepping of nails, see, we get nails for here. What will you talk about prepping of nails? Prepping of nails is the foundation of our nails. Foundation of any nails where you want to. This one is the solid foundation. You won't build us, you know the foundation. What do you want to take? I want to carry and reach up. I don't even know much. I don't get one, but God go down. But at the same time, you won't build us. You need foundation. That's the same thing that applies to nails. We go need foundation for our nails too. And this one, I go determine how long your nails will stay. If you don't do them well, your customer will come back. You go do them again. And if they complain the third time, they will not come back. So you see, say they important very well. So. If we talk about prepping of nails, what are the things we will need for prepping of nails? We go need our pusher. I know someone I remember this. And I just say I I believe say I don't get this ones for house because as I talk for the last class, me when I get my materials ready. So this one are the pusher, and this one we they go with first. So the pusher, what in the pusher they do to push? The natural nails back. This is how they push my push uh, my client nails. Let's say my student and my client. So, so this is how they push a cortical back. The reason why would they push cortical back? If they give us space to work on, and it go give it go allow us to see the dead cell of the cortical. If you not push, you don't go fit trim. If you trim, you go just cut your customer. But this one. As you push back, you go see all the space where they did. You will get short nails, now you're not going to enjoy this pushing most. So we go push this one too. Now all your nails will go push you. Just relax. Don't go too much. If you go too deep, you go hurt your customer. Don't go too deep. Just you go just push them back. And then something where they did this pushing. If you did push, try as much as possible. Say all the or your 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 um your cortical area they align with each other it they round it give us that round that beautiful shape for nails you know that one you know we'll say you know we we'll know the value now now when you finish your nails you go the same so you go push back so now we don't push what will they do next we go need our file and this one we go need next this file now we go take Redo, remove all the shiny, shiny way they the nails. We go use and remove them. But something way they with this file. If I remember the last class, at the time when I said that 80 by 100 degree. Maybe just say I just they talk the number of one to so just hear. You get why? It is advisable. Say if you want hold your file, hold them minimum 70, 70, 30, 70 new to do help. This is 70. I know I had me measure around for house, but for my eyes, this one at 70, this other one at 30. Say, if you want order 80, 20, this one at 80. 80 day up, 20 day down. Now, so I go hold your file. Not just hold file, like they say, the file nails. No hold file like that, though. You know, be farmer, you be nail tech, or na nail tech, you won't become. <laughs> now, give it to and they talk. So, when I go hold them 70 30, and you go very mild. If you hold this one, the reason why we are holding it 70 30, it will be just for fashion. If you hold for 70 30, you no go put too much pressure for your client's nails. She no go feel, say, you defile nails. Some people get tender nails sometimes, say, then go feel them. But me, they know if you say yes, then they do nails with pain. If you want to do nails, it's supposed to come with a relief. Say, okay, oh, I just want to go relax my body. May everything just they shine, shine fine for my body. Now, why would they do nails? So you go all on 70 30 or 80 20. Anyone way they convenient for you, just all on like that. So you go go by filing. And if you want file, you start by from the side. You, you don't just file, say you just want file anyhow. Start from the side. Take it like this. 
then come back like this. That's how you file your news. File like a professional. Don't just file like say, you just the O5 files. Now why we get this class? So, now so we will go start with the file and from side to side. Wait till my people, I don't even forget. This dust collector, now remember and say I talked about the last time. You see, say, you don't dare on like this, I don't dare use them. The people say all the dust, all the things where I want to find, you go, they go inside. Now you go, they collect them inside. Instead of my face, go, they collect them. Now you go, they collect them. So this place don't go, they messy. So we don't start, you go start from the side. Very gentle. Then you go back like this. You don't need to file much. Now the shyness, once you, once you say yes, everything don't come out. The shine, you know they say anything shine, shine again. Compared to this one, you see the difference? This one they shine, this one no shine. Now we think we just won't file for there with that. So we go come move to another one again. You file like that from side. You say, I know go like, I know hold my file like this. I know file like this so. I know hold my file like this. If I hold on like this, say I have the file like this, I just, I just they put all the pressure on the natural news, and then that with that self, I they damage the person news. If the person don't complete say the thing, I they damage the news. So you still hold your file like this. See one hand there on that. This one they support them. This three day hop. I say you go hold your file. Let me just say you go hold any hand. So we go side. By side, we come back, we go again. See this one compared to this one. When we are shaping natural nails, no be the same thing. When we are shaping natural nails, no be the same thing it will give you with artificial nails. If you shape artificial nails, say you don't fix the nails, you just want shape and right round, you get more space to work on. But this one, see and see how our natural nails look. So I want shape round, I want to shape a round shape. No be say I will not go extra mile to shape the round. Now just to just make this side come in. See the difference of this one and this one. This one they sharp. This one don't go in. Now what do we mean by that? So you don't do too much when it comes to natural nails. Now just say, uh, now your artificial nails, you go feel show the round well well. If you reach that stage, I go show now. So now go see the different work. Try, tell me you just pick this one, how it look. Because this one I just gel polish, you won't apply for this one. Maybe we just assume them. So the same thing applies to this one. See, say now just the corner. You start from the corner. If you want shape round, any round where you want shape, you start from the corner, inner corner like this. Now where you get where you get uh, where you get work with that. Go back to this inner corner too. You don't need to do too much. See this one compared to this one. You don't need to do too much. Don't stress yourself. You know, not in day there. Not in day nails. I just, if you don't know, I'm not in you know, but you just see the, the tutorial now. Not in day there. Carry your file like that. You get sister for household. You get friend. Carry their nails. Maybe you just practice with this one first. If you start from the beginning, now, now why, now how you go take understand that if you can't reach the you know, say oh, yes, they don't they day or we don't they go too deep. But if you don't start from now, I you want to get that one. So let's start. Find somebody for that house. You know what make I can fight you. Find somebody for that place. So as we continue, the same thing, we will just do the same thing. Start from the inner corner. No magic. Go go to inner corner of this one too. So, or in the outer corner, now I'm going to my back, put the English in myself. Just, now wait till you just need, just round it. You don't need too much. Because say you want to do round shape, look, I show my student so that she will see 
What your nails look like? Do you like your nails? You can't wait at it. Let me say your customer one round shape for a natural you can't cut all her nails. No. She will be happy with what she wants at the end of the day. By the time we finish her. So you go back again and then note something. When I'm filing, if you don't notice that as I did file since, I no touch where I don't file before. Don't touch your client's nails. Don't use your hand to touch it. You can work without glove. Don't put your hand on the surface. Once you put your hand on the surface, you go back with your file again and file it. Once you make that mistake, say, ah, I mistakenly touch this part. You go back and file it. That is part of the prepping. If you don't use your hand, touch them again. You don't even spoil that prepping itself. The nail go lift. It go lift. No, we say not magic. It go lift because you don't put your own natural hair back. And the reason why we filed at first was because we won't come on the natural natural hair with the nails. No, we say we just you just they use and they do style. Now the oil. So if you can use that hand, press them or touch them mistakenly back. You don't have that oil back again. So you see what's at the top. So make I show one. See as I hold my, my client's nails. I no touch her nails. See where her nails did. See where her nails did. You will see I will take the file I'm now. Start from the inner corner. You just have to be careful. Not in the day. You know they had inner corner. Or make I make I tell her this magic. If you don't say you know if you do without touching her nails when you when you are shaping, shape first before you file. It is still not the same thing. You know, say yes, so ah, if I won't file the nails, my hand will touch them. Oh no, oh no. Shape first before you file. It is simple. So that you know, go just they go back, go back, go back, file, 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 file. You don't damage your clients, no, do that. So, you go just go like this. File them. As we don't they talk and say, still the same thing they do. File them. Side to side. And that is it. You see them? The same thing applies to this one too. Good. Now we are done shaping. We don't finish our nails. We don't shape and finish like this. What next? We go trim the cortical. You say we don't push them back before. You see the difference? You see the difference? We go push them back. We don't push them. We don't already push them back. So that part, that dead, uh, cortical dead cell, you don't see them. You don't see them. As I the person like this, you don't go through the pain because I don't already push them from the actual skin. So now we won't trim them. As I explained in the previous class, we get nipper and we get cortical trimmer. I will practicalize the two for now. Me will not see how we take this out. This is trimmer. Me will go first with trimmer. If you want to use trimmer, anything where you want to trim, you start from the corner. Corner like this, you trim. Don't start your trimming from the middle. Don't start your trimming from the end. Start from the corner. So you go feel give you that beautiful shape, that round shape where you want. You will feel walk and straight. If you don't start from this uh, part, you only scatter, 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 scatter the, the cortical. Play of it to just go smoothly and that round to give you that round shape. Maybe everybody get round uh, cortical though. And people get square. No matter how you package and package them, you will still give you that square. But regardless, it will still work with them because all of us now different fingers we get. So me will use our trimmer. If you want trim, you use your hand. This two hand. No, they're not. They're not doing magic here. I don't just use and hold the nails. No, they know they do magic for here. Hold and down. Use it to press it down. I'm pressing my client with not in a artful way. Just press and down, so that if you won't work with them, it will be easy. You will know, cut cutting. So now I won't start. See, I go take you on. Yeah. 
see you see the difference of this one and this one. I don't trim her. At the portable trimmer that if you are trimming you can go in as much as possible you say you don't trim the first one there are still some things small dirty for there go back trim and again but if you want to you go still go back trim mom to wait till you want trim mom say you go this smooth so that by the time you paint on it you go see the beauty of that nails okay so now I won't use the nipper now so I don't explain before. See as I carry my hand, you go in from the corner. See I'm I hold them back. Oh. For nipper, now so you go all nipper. Don't be the same only don't be the same way where you go all your trimmer, you go all nipper. If you get convenience for you, all I mean, but my own be say make you know she have cut your client's nails and nails you study how they take all my own. So I hold them back. So that I go see where I want to walk on. As, as, as I trim them, but to me, eh, I prefer this one because this one eh, I don't know where, to, where I want to work on. It get faster for me instead of me pressing, pressing, checking if they if they okay or not. So I will continue to use this one for myself. Relax. Man. This sharp sharp, I don't finish. You see, I'm, I would prefer them to this one. If I touch and smell. But some people just they insist say they like me more. Now even if they use me for most times shower. This one and Nigeria we do. And not the same figures we will get together. Just the trim, man. So that I go do it. You go see where we want work on. Even if the person don't want paint, if my man nails you, they just say, I just want clean my nails though. This one like this, you get how much where you go charge for what you they do. Because if we don't finish, you go compare the other hand to this one. So if you finish this one, both fan. Tell your client, may your she wash them. Put particular oil. You know how much you go collect. You are good to go. No stress. You see them. You see them. See, compared to this one. You don't see the difference. You see the difference of the two. So as you don't finish like this, Nigel polish with one paint. We will need our buffer, so we will just buff the nails. As I explained in the previous class, buffer now to smooth the nails where we don't fail. So when we paint, our paint can be smooth and look nice. You see, as I defile, I've been a buffer, everything I the same. So you just go with your buffer. In a simple way, you don't have to, to put a pressure on it. You're not doing much. And look at the way I'm holding my buffer. It's still 70 30. Or probably if you want it 80 20, don't hold your buffer like this and put it on your client's nails. You just want to put pressure for the, for the nails. And you go, go they pay your client. Even this one, the client will go see the feel and small, small. 
not to now talk of say you put all the all your pressure on it and that is it wait till they do next toast them now why we get this now wait till they explain for the previous client nothing much just toast them if you don't dust finish you need your um, cutting wool just a little of your cutting wool then your dissolver Clean. You clean. What will they do next? We could put our primer. Note whenever you are putting your primer, in, I beg no let her reach the skin. You get why? Just be careful as much as possible. The primer just be like water on our spirit and go color. If you see them for face, it be like water. But if you put them for the nails, the client go feel and say it be like seeing a spirit. On a primer, the foundation of your nails, since I just put them. I would think you just need be this. And now we are done with our prepping. Every time they talk about prepping, say if person will apply job, now be this. If now acrylic you won't do, you know go buff them. And the difference with that. If you won't fix your top arm, say you won't fix on a stick on because if you won't fix stick on a full, you go fill them, you go fix them. Then you go see anything left. That one, you know, just buff them, fix them. If now just paint, now what will buff them? and we put primer. If no be painting, you no go buffer before you fix. Please write that one down, no time. So if you reach that stage, you no go get confused. Now everything we're there about prepping be that. Now see say nothing they day. I beg, as we don't do it like this, me yourself try practice and for house. And even my students, try to get person where you go practice and on. And I hope you people enjoy today's class on learning skill. If you really enjoy him, join us same class next week. Bye! Bye.